But are you ready? Give me a drum roll, DJ. Blah, 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 blah. Boom. That's the best drum roll I ever heard. Subscribe and hit that bell button to join the Bright Army and be part of the Bright and Early Squad. Welcome back, Brights. I'm Sabrina Bright, and today on Terabyte Games, we're going to be making some shiny Atlantis legendaries. Are you ready? I sure am. Let's get right into it. Before we do it, let's do a bright like spike. On the count of three, I'm going to say smash a doodly D's, and we're all going to smash a doodly D. You ready? One, two, three. DJ, what is it? Smash a doodly D's. Smash a doodly D's. I thought we were going to like sing it. Huh? <laughs> I thought we were going to like go off of each other, but you didn't you didn't quite catch that. Oh. Need bright juice? Well, we have a bright juice shirt in our merch store. Link in the description. So first of all, yesterday we uploaded three videos covering the Atlantis update. I beat everything and I got the Atlantis Overlord, which is the best reward pet in the new world Atlantis over here. Which, uh, so if you didn't catch up on all those videos, make sure you go catch up right now. And also there's a new video uploaded today to RB Battles. We collabed with the Bloxy Bunch, which is our old collab group with Ashley the Unicorn and Darzeth. So we had them as special guests on RB Battles. So make sure to go check that out. We'll pin the link in the comment below or you can just go to RB Battles YouTube channel and make sure you subscribe if you haven't yet because it's pretty awesome over there. But anyway, Anyway, let's go ahead to Atlantis and see what we can do. We're gonna be trying to make a shiny of the best pet that we can get right now in Atlantis, which is this dark jellyfish right here for 0.02% rarity. Okay, I don't know why I'm yelling at you. I'm so sorry. I have a lot of energy today. <laughs> so we're gonna be trying to make a shiny dark elemental. Maybe we'll be able to make a dark jellyfish because DJ and I have hatched a few and together if we combine them, we might be able to make a shiny version of that. And then we also might try, but I'm not really quite sure if we can, to make shiny versions of these legendaries. It would be pretty sick to have a shiny version of every single legendary, but but really all that really matters is these because they're more powerful than this egg, obviously. So we're gonna go ahead first and should I like collect some shells, DJ? Sure. I need to equip a better team right now. So my best team was this right here. Oh my gosh, I've got a shiny Atlantis Guardian, which is the Robux pet. Yes, we bought 10 of them. We are insane. And then we uh, have a bunch of dark jellyfishes and we've got an Atlantis hybrid, which we got from rewards, which is a pretty good pet and a dark elemental as well, obviously, is my Atlantis Overlord. Are you jealous, DJ? Can you trade it to me? I want it. I'll let you use it. Give me. Hold is on, Is it even though. tradable? Oh, I don't know. It might not be since it's a reward pet. So first, let me just go ahead and collect these. Make sure my two times... Yes, I do have two times pearls on, so that's good. Just go ahead and get these. That was a lot of pearls. DJ has a full jellyfish team, dark jellyfish team. Look at that. That looks insane. He thinks he's taking over the world. I got but 3 I'm 323 million from one. I got, I'm buying it because I have no idea how much I got. I got 592 million. Wow, that overlord. I know, it's insane. Plus I've already leveled these up a lot. Like my dark jellyfish, the highest one I have is a level 18. Whoa. Yeah, so I worked really hard leveling these up so that I could get rewards. So yeah, that's why I'm a uh, OP. So collectively, we have enough to make a shiny dark jellyfish right off the bat. I can't talk, I said fish. <laughs> jellyfish. 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 So I have a total of four of them. How many do you have, DJ? And also, how many dark elementals do you have? I wonder if I have more than one. Oh, I only have one dark elemental. I how have, I have like a hundred dark elementals. What? Are you serious? Do you really have like a ton? Yeah. What the heck, DJ? DJ's crazy. What? And I, I yeah, I, okay. I have a lot of jellyfish too. So we, we usually get the boost, the two times uh, increased luck. I'm gonna go ahead and buy it right now just so we can see. It stays, it stays on your account when you leave, so that's good. With two times luck, the dark elemental is actually 0.12%, which is actually not that bad. If you were sitting here grinding this egg all day with times two, times three eggs, times two hatching speed, and good luck, you know, you're gonna get a ton of those actually. So I understand why you have a ton, DJ. So let's go ahead and do a little trade roo and just make some jellyfish and some dark elementals shiny. And then we're gonna go ahead and max level them and see what we can do with them. How many dark elementals do you need? I only have one, so I'm gonna need nine. All right. All right, trade me. By the way, thank you guys for wishing me well. My TMJ has been something I've been suffering with for a while, so it's kind of annoying, but I really appreciate the good wishes. All right, so first just send me, okay, you can send me all those. Yes, send them all to me, DJ, send them all to me. I, I need want one more. a million dark elementals, please. 
You need one more, right? Yes, I need one more, and then I'll need six dark jellyfishes. How about we, we take it one at a time? Why don't you do the dark elemental first? All right. Confirm! Thank you, DJ. How do you have more jellyfishes than dark elementals? Because I got two jellyfishes and one dark elemental somehow. And you gave me two. So we now have 10 dark elementals. Let's go ahead and see what the base stat of this pet is first because the one I have equipped is leveled up right now. Okay, so these are all leveled up a little bit because DJ had them equipped for a while. Um, so they're level two, barely leveled up, but it's 588 pearl multiplier at a level two. So you can see that it's really not like amazing, but it's gonna be on par with the dark jellyfish once I do make it shiny. So let's go ahead and do it. Are you ready? Give me a drum roll, DJ. Blah, 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 blah. Boom. <laughs> That's the best drum roll I ever heard. So now we have a shiny dark elemental. What will this thing look like? I'm gonna unequip all pets and equip this thing right now and see what it looks like. Oh my gosh. It's literally white. It's the opposite color. That's Whoa. sick. Holy moly. It looks it looks kind of cool. I like what white Dude, and red. Dude, it together. literally looks so modern. And it is a 1130 pearl multiplier, which is really good, actually. And if we max level and max enchant this thing, it's going to be pretty strong. So I'm pretty happy with this. So let's go ahead and make a dark jellyfish now. Are you ready to trade, DJ? So what do you think this one's going to look like? It's black and red. I think it's going to be white. I think it's going to be the same thing. You think so? Yeah. You think its eyes are going to be red even though its eyes are already red? Well, what color is the eyes of the other one? They're still red. I don't know. Hmm. So how many do you need? So I currently have four. But the thing is, I already leveled some of these up. So I feel weird. All right. I'll, I'll okay, give just, just, yeah, just give me six. It's fine. I can make it shine. I'll give you eight. So one... I'll give two. you eight. I have eight. I'm just so Wait, rich I'm gonna give dark, you my low level ones, though. dark jellyfish. One, two, three, <laughs> four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. What the heck? What? Um, DJ? What? Uh, I don't think we need to make a shiny. <laughs> I just gave you my low level ones. I, I don't... DJ, I don't think we need to make a, a shiny for this episode. Why? Well... Oh, it's shiny! <laughs> what the heck? How'd you not notice? You hatched the shiny! I hatched the shiny! Oh my gosh! You know what this means, right? This means... It means I have a shiny and I'm gonna take over the world! <laughs> this means we don't even have to waste all those jellyfish you have equipped. You can stay powerful and OP and level them up and have a shiny. This is like good news. We don't have to get rid of all of those. Or we can make two shinies. Or that. <laughs> Dude, that's insane. I can't believe you hatched a shiny. Oh my gosh, guys. What is DJ's luck? He's... You thought I was stealing all the bright juice the past day? No. DJ still has all the bright juice. <laughs> my bright juice. Oh my gosh. All right, let's see what this thing is all about. It's gonna be OP. A shiny dark jellyfish based out of 1,600 pearl multiplier. Let's go ahead and bring this bad boy out. Holy moly, that is so cool looking. Oh my gosh, wait, what if my entire team was shiny, DJ? Look, what if my whole team was just white pets? That'd be sick. And yours are all black and we're like, we're like opposites. Like we're, you're the villain and I'm the good guy. Yeah, but then <laughs> you'd be more powerful. I know. It's not fair. Because the good guy always wins, okay? No. <laughs> Never. You fool. <laughs> All right, so basically what I'm gonna do now is take these to XP Island. We're also gonna collect some pearls with them and try to level them up and make them shiny. Now we never made a video yet on if it's better to max enchant and then level up max to 25 or if it's better to do it the other way around. So I really just don't know. All right guys, so in the chat, DJ just said, what do you guys think is it better to level first or enchant first? Cuddle Monkey said, Enchant and super crim 43 said level up saran said I choose enchant so I, I don't know We're gonna have to in the next video do a test and do one where we level up max first and then enchant And then do a, the same exact pet where we max enchant first then level up I don't know which one's better to do first We're gonna do some math and then I've seen comments in the last video I mentioned this in that said it doesn't matter. It's the same number in the end. But what their argument is that if you level up first, it's cheaper to enchant. Or if you enchant first, it's cheaper to level. So we don't know like what is the best approach. We have no idea. 
So I'm just gonna go ahead and do what I normally do, which is I max level it first and then I start enchanting. Which I don't really get very far normally with enchanting because it costs tons of pearls. Maybe you should do enchant because it seems like the majority of the chat thinks you en should enchant first. Maybe okay. you should do that. Okay, we're gonna do it backwards today. I'm gonna enchant first. So I already have them at a level three, but that's not really gonna do much. So we're gonna go ahead. I'm just gonna see right now if I can start enchanting them right here, right now. 100,000, let me do the other one too. Enchant 20. Oh, this one's way cheaper. All right, so I don't even know how many pearls I have. We're gonna go to Atlantis and see how many pearls we have. We have 1.8 billion left. So let's just keep working on this jellyfish. 3.8. So I'm in the millions right now. Oh, wow. I'm actually gonna be able to max enchant this thing. Oh my gosh. I just max enchanted the dark jellyfish. Maybe they're right, dude. Oh my goodness. Well, these pets are a lot, they're probably gonna cost a lot less to enchant than the new eggs that are gonna come out in this area in the future because those are gonna be more powerful pets. I think the more powerful the pet, the more it costs to enchant because the uh, dark elemental is way cheaper to enchant than the dark jellyfish. So, but let's go ahead and max enchant this thing, this dark elemental. Oh my gosh, we're flying through it. Yes, all right, so I still have a billion shells left, wow. So that really wasn't expensive compared to like what I'm used to. I don't know if it's just how it is or if, if it is better to enchant first, but we got that out of the way. The pets are now fully enchanted and we're gonna go ahead and work on leveling them up. Since they're shiny, it's gonna take double the time to level it up than a normal pet. And I have two equipped. So this is gonna cost and take a lot. It's gonna take a lot of time. The good news is, this chest is not too expensive. It's 79 Robux to spawn. So yeah, we're gonna do that. 50,000. So I get 50,000 XP to split between the two pets um, from this chest. And then I get like 3,000 up to 13,000 to split between um, from these stars. But when I collect like pearls and stuff and the chests laying around, there's only a couple hundred per chest. I did see a comment on the last video of someone telling me that it levels up your pets faster or more if you collect the chests laying around um, instead of the XP island stars. And I do not think that is true because you only get like two to 300 per thing. I will go back and collect some though, just to show you guys. The pets are now level seven, but we gotta get to a level 25 to maximize the powerfulness of these pets so we can take over the world before DJ does. And when I take over the world, it's gonna be in a good way because I'm the good guy and DJ's the bad guy. I ran out of Robux. So I got these leveled up to a level nine. Let's see how far up they are. So not very far up through level nine, right in the beginning of it. We have to get all the way to level 25. That's so tough because these pets are shiny. And like I said, it's double, it takes double to level it up all the way. All right, so for these, see that I got 1,500, so that's actually pretty good, but still not as good as the stars or the big chest that I was spawning with Robux. It's definitely helpful though, because you're getting currency for, for spending at the same time. So you're doing two things that are needed at once. All right, Bright, so this took a really long time, believe it or not. I gave it over to DJ and then he bought some spawns of this chest with his Robux as well. We both, and I used all my Robux. <laughs> we both used all our Robux, but this is an investment on these pets because they're gonna help us get lots of plur plurals? Lots of pearls for the next update and grinding for the best pets coming up. So we're about to hit a level 25 and there you have it. We have a level 25 max enchanted dark jellyfish. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> That's insane. I just kept it out by itself to give all the XP to it because the other one that I have, I only have it at a level 22, which is very close to being max level. So I just figured I would focus on the most OP pet for the time being because we were running out of time because we have to go record some RB battles. So we have to kind of end the video soon. So I wanted to hurry up and get that jellyfish max leveled and that is what we did. So right now our dark elemental is a level 22, only three more levels to go till it's max level and it's already 2,683.75 pearl multiplier. That is literally amazing and definitely one of like one of the best pets I could have right now for the new world. Let's go ahead and collect with this. <laughs> and for the big reveal, are you ready to see the dark jellyfish's stats? Give me a drum roll, DJ. <laughs> Holy moly! It's 4,000 on the dot, DJ. 4,000 thousand pearl Whoa. multiplier. 
That is max level, max enchanted dark jellyfish. That's insane. I cannot believe this. So if I have a max level pet, does the XP split and or does it all go to the one that's not max level? Let's see. 3,000. Oh, wait. Yeah, it still splits it in half. So make sure if you have a max level pet out to unequip it if you're doing any leveling up because it does split the amount. So I want to go ahead and finish this off camera, but I'm definitely going to be max upgrading this dark elemental because it's pretty strong. It is very strong actually. So the best pet you can get right now from Atlantis is of course the Atlantis Overlord. So our Atlantis Overlord is, wow, 5,160 pearl multiplier. So it currently still is the best pet and I have it max leveled. I just got to start enchanting it more. I have had it enchanted at a level six. But let's go ahead and equip it. So here is my new team. It is so strong. Oh my gosh, it's literally so OP. Let's go ahead and see how much we get now with these new shinies in our team. Max enchanted and max upgraded, almost max upgraded on the dark elemental. We're really close, okay guys, we'll get there. But let's go ahead and spawn that chest in the last area in Atlantis and see how much we get because we're gonna be getting tons of pearls. Are you ready? DJ, how much do you think we're gonna get? Two gazillion. <laughs> Oh, it only has 17 minutes left till it spawns. I feel weird buying it. What do you think? You only yellow once. All right. You only live, you only live once. But you only live once, you only live once. Is that what you're trying to say? 804 million? What? Oh my. Wow. 804 million, DJ. What the heck? We're gonna go ahead and enchant this now. I enchanted my <laughs> Atlantis Overlord again. Now it's enchanted to a level seven. I mean, enchantment of seven, and it is 5,222. Oh my gosh, my pets are so strong. For the record, it'd be you only, you only live once, once. That's what okay. it would have been. Okay. So currently my weakest pet is the Atlantis Hybrid. So I'm gonna find a way to replace that. We're gonna find a way to get to a billion every time we collect this chest. We're gonna become so OP we take over the world, okay? But we're gonna have to stop right here. So if you were new, make sure you do hit that subscribe button to join the Bright Army. Check out some videos you may have missed over there. And thank you guys so much for watching. Have a wonderful day. Bye.